So, you've come to the Latrobe Library and you want to look at some articles from, say, 1969, July 21st, moon landing, and you want to use this microfilm scanner, but you have no idea how to do it and there's no instructions anywhere. So, we're going to show you how to do it. First, you'll need to go down to the library front desk and borrow these lenses. There'll be two for two different magnifications, but you should only need the 9.5 times 6 one. So take the lens out, let's put it on the desk for now. First thing, turn on the scanner. And you'll have to move your slide across to the left. Then the thing that holds the actual tapes, you'll need to bring that forward. Okay, so this is our box of film microfilm. Just take it out. Don't worry about getting your fingerprints stuck on the, the first bit because that's just all blank specifically for this purpose so that you don't damage it while you're putting it in. Now just insert your reel. And then feed it in slowly underneath this little roller. This one here. Until it gets to the other side and this little knob here will spin this spindle quickly and slowly so turn it a little bit clockwise and slowly move the film in until it grabs it now sometimes if it doesn't grab it properly you'll see that it's just gone out a bit and that can cause the film to just break if you accidentally keep spinning it. So just bring it back a little bit. Get it back in. And now you can see that it's wrapped around fairly well. So if it actually didn't, just put your finger in there to bring it to wrap it around and slowly turn the dial. And there you go, it's grabbed onto the film. Now, you'll see that there's nothing on the screen. That's because we still need to put the lens in. The lens has two dials. The first one is the zoom, the bottom one is the focus. On the actual scanner, there's this little dial at the top, this one here and that's rotation. So, you just put your lens in, move the whole apparatus back until you're over a section of film. That's black at the moment because it's just the start of the roll. So slowly turn the dial and your film should go through. Edit this out. We can fast forward here. <laughs> yeah. Alright, that's just indicating the start of the roll. Roll number. Okay, on this page, you might want to just adjust your lens so that you can read the whole page. Move the whole apparatus to move the film up and down, like so, and use the zoom to. Zoom out a bit. This page isn't very good to adjust because you don't have the article, but get it right a little bit. And now we've got our first page. We'll make some adjustments. And zoom. And focus. This is our front page of the age, and it seems we're in focus, and now we're going to scroll through the newspaper and get to July 21st. 
you notice this knob on the left, which you use to scrolling through. Turn it slowly, and it will scroll through slowly. Turn it a little bit further, and it will click. That indicates that it's ready to fast scroll, and so you can go further and just scroll. We're looking for July 21st, that's July 5th. Oh, here we go. Yeah. And so here's our page. July 21st, 1969. Okay, I really like this page and I'd like to save it and maybe print it off later or just have it with me on a memory stick. So do that, you open up Capture Perfect, File, Scan to Page. The scanner will take that in, transfer it. And then you can see our front page. And you go File, Save As. Now save it as a JPEG, and the compression type is JPEG. And we'll call this down to the moon and save. And that's it. If you want to scan more pages, just repeat the process. Or if, say, for example, I would like this little article down here called Astronauts to Carry Toolkit, but it might not be that readable at this size. So we'll go back to the scanner. We'll zoom in using the lens. Move our film across a bit. Adjust the focus. And I'll move that to the center of the page to make sure that we get a good scan. All right. I'll scan the page again. And now I've got this article and it's very readable. And you can save that as well. To pack up, you'll close the program, log off. Go back to the scanner, zoom out completely, although it doesn't really matter. And now, there's the fast scrolling and the slow scrolling. You can actually just fast scroll all the way back and the film will just start spinning around the spindle. So it's perfectly safe to do that. Take our roll of film out. Just pull it a bit. Pull it around. Place it back in the box. We'll take our lens out. Also replace that. Move this back, slide this across, and turn it off. And that's it. And that's how you scan microfilm at Latrobe University. Thank you. Cool.